Item number SCP-6035. Object class safe. Update neutralized. Special containment procedures. SCP-6035 is currently secured in a standard high value storage locker at Site-73 to prevent possible reactivation of its anomalous properties. It may not be removed from its current location without permission from the site director. Description SCP-6035 is a vinyl LP of the 1980 album Is This Real by the punk rock band Wipers. When not activated, SCP-6035 is identical to non-anomalous vinyls of the same album. SCP-6035's anomalous properties manifested when it was placed on any working turntable or other device that is intended for the use of vinyl records. When the first song, titled Return of the Rat, was played, two large anthropomorphic entities resembling common brown rats, carrying electric guitars, manifested in the immediate vicinity of SCP-6035. These entities designated SCP-6035-A and SCP-6035-B would then proceed to act out the lyrics of the song in a most neat literal manner and had elongated human-like arms and legs for this purpose. The subject who activated the record would be periodically interacted with as the song progressed. Once we turned the rat concluded, the entities demanifested and the rest of the record could be played with no anomalous effects. Sample SCP-6035 Test Test Subject D-53995 Subject is instructed to place SCP-6035 on a testing turntable, play the record, and observe the results. 0 minutes, 0 seconds to 10 seconds. SCP-6035-A appears within the testing room and begins playing its guitar at 5 seconds. Opening instrumental. 10 seconds to 20 seconds. SCP-6035-A stops playing its guitar and a map of the United States appears in hand. SCP-6035-A scrutinizes the map closely before showing it to D-53995 and pointing at it excitedly. Corresponds to lyrics urging the listener to stay alert and remain aware due to unspecified persons arriving from throughout the country. 20 seconds to 44 seconds. A vocalizes the chorus and continues to play its guitar. These are the only words spoken by A and B throughout the manifestation event. Eponymous chorus and instrumental. 45 seconds to 54 seconds. B manifest carrying a Bible and wearing the attire of a Catholic priest. It then proceeds to beat D 53995 over the head with the Bible for several seconds before pointing its finger at her in an accusatory manner. Corresponds to lyrics in which the singer urges unnamed persons to confess to an unspecified action. 25 seconds to 1 minute 50 seconds. As the chorus and guitar solo begin, B discards its Bible and an electric guitar appears in its hands. A and B then vocalize the chorus before reproducing the guitar solo from the song. Chorus, guitar solo. 1 minute 51 seconds to 2 minutes. A and B appear on either side of D53995 and grab her shoulders while pointing around the test chamber in an agitated manner. Corresponds to lyrics identical to the verse from 10 seconds to 20 seconds, but with an unspecified room reference in place of a country. 2 minutes and 1 second to 2 minutes 37 seconds. A and B vocalize the chorus and play the instrumental that concludes the song. Following the end of the track, they both take a short bow and immediately 
the manifest before the next song, Mystery Plays. Chorus, Glowing Instrumental. Addendum, 6035A, Accidental Neutralization of SCP-6035. On the 22nd of October, 2019, SCP-6035 was accidentally neutralized during regular testing. Following the conclusion of a standard test, researchers instructed the test subject D46924 to remove SCP-6035 from the testing turntable and immediately replace it with a non-anonymous final of eight songs for Greg Sage and the Wipers. A 1992 tribute album consisting of covers of various Wipers songs. Following the conclusion of the third song on the album, a cover of Return of the Rat by the Grunge band Nirvana, SCP-6035-A and SCP-6035-B. Note, neither could be distinctly identified due to the identical physical features and atypical actions manifested in the testing chamber. One was wearing a Nirvana-themed shirt, and the other a shirt which mimicked the cover art for Is This Real? Both entities then made loud screeching vocalizations at one another in an apparently argumentative manner for the next five minutes. At the conclusion of the argument, the SCP-6035 A or B instance, wearing the Nirvana shirt, picking up SCP-6035 and threw it against the testing chamber wall. Both instances then slowly walked towards the opposite end of the testing chamber before the manifesting. Following the event, SCP-6035 displayed no anomalous properties in its subsequent activations. SCP-6035-A and SCP-6035-B have not appeared since the aforementioned test. SCP-6035 has been reclassified as neutralized.